for the sixth race. Second, New Jersey Sire Stakes Division for three-year-old pacing fillies all in behind the gate, and they're approaching the start. And their off-blowing report pushes the gate away from the outside, now firing out from between horses. Majestic Eagle as blowing report backs off a bit. BJ's Sunset is up close, and she'll cut the corner with a short lead. Queen Othra is in behind them third. Glowing report driving on from fourth. Apple Crisp has come away racing in fifth. Sixth on the inside is Ted's Girl as they circle the turn. Heather's Gambit has come out in seventh. Eighth and looking to settle in is Summer Mystery. Ninth in behind her, Contempt of Court and School of Card Knox trails the field. First quarter in 26 and 3. BJ's Sunset is on the lead. Majestic Eagle is in behind her in second. Apple Crisp is on the move for the Catman on the outside. She's first up, now third, and Glowing Report is tipped out and underway as the pace is slowed down the backstretch. Campbell wrestling with Queen Otro is now back in fifth as Apple Crisp looks to pace around to the front and Glowing Report is coming quickly so just as Apple Crisp clears Glowing Report applies immediate pressure the half in a contested 54 and 4. BJ Sunset is in behind the battle from third right there in fourth Majestic Eagle as they hit the far turn Queen Otra two lengths further back fifth Ted's Girl racing six Glowing Report cannot get around Apple Crisp and she has her parked out and these two are slugging it out as they come to the three quarter marker tipping off the cones Majestic Majestic Eagle is now out with second over cover. Apple Crisp with the inside advantage retakes the lead. Top trip for Glowing Report stuck first over. BJ Sunset needs a way through. Three quarters and one twenty-two flat. And it's Apple Crisp who leads it with an eighth of a mile to come. Apple Crisp is a length in front of BJ Sunset. Ted's Girl slides up the cones and angles out. Apple Crisp is now two lengths in front. Ted's Girl trying to get to her with the late rally. BJ Sunset third. Apple Crisp. Ted's Girl one last surge, charging hard. These two, Apple Crisp held on from Ted's girl. BJ Sunset third, one, 49 and four. World pacing fillies as Apple Crisp is the winner and those results have been posted official. Number four, Apple Crisp is a life-signed three-year-old filly out of Candy Apple Red by Jate Lobel, all by the Royal Wire Products Incorporated of North Royalton, Ohio. Don Swick is the trainer, and Cat Manzi is in the sulky. Apple Crisp has now won three races so far this year. The time, 1.49 and 4, obviously a career best for her, and a track record equaling performance for three-year-old pacing fillies at the Meadowlands. In the winner's circle, to make the trophy presentation from UPS, we welcome Cindy Hansalt, and she is joined by John Ipok and Laszlo Probelski, making presentation to trainer Don Swick, driver Kat Manzi, and the connections of Apple Crisp. Number four, Apple Crisp, back-to-back -back Ken Workington selections tonight, 620, 340, and 280. Finishing second, number three, Ted's Girl, 540, and 360. And third, number two, BJ's Sunset, 420. Exact of four and three, 3220. The 432 trifecta, 189, 80.